Hey mama, welcome to the Fit Postpartum Mom Podcast. This is episode 84. I'm Jenna, I'm your host, and I can't wait to help teach you about C-section scar massage. That's right, this is a big topic, but we're just going to get right into the the beginning stages of this. This is C-section scar massage 101. We are just going to get you comfortable with the idea of c-section scar massage understanding what it is and how to do it and when to do it and all the nitty-gritty things to just get you started because this is important you need to know how to do this in order to have proper healing are you ready to learn let's go Hey friend, welcome to the Fit Postpartum Mom Podcast, where you will learn how to strengthen your body after pregnancy and finally get rid of the postpartum pooch in less time. Fitness can fit easily into your busy schedule. There's a simple way to navigate your postpartum journey, and I'm here to teach you how to do it without the chaos, overwhelm, and tears. If you are here for a little sweat, a whole lot of sleep, defined, tight, and toned muscles, and to live your life as a mom to the fullest, then you're in the right place. Hi, I'm Dr. Jenna, but you can call me Jenna, and I'm a physical therapist and a mom of four little girls who has cracked the code on how to strengthen your core postpartum in the easiest way possible without the stress, exhaustion, or struggle. I did it, and now I'm here to help you do the same. It's all about progress, not perfection, and I'm here to help walk you through the journey to feeling strong, confident, and energized. That energy comes from within, not your coffee. Let's roll out your yoga mat and hit the floor, girl. It's time to do this. Hey, Mama. If you are really having a hard time recovering from your pregnancy and you still have that lingering pooch, the mommy tummy, the extra baby weight that's lingering around, I'd love to help you. This is the thing that I like to do the most. I like to help moms feel confident in their skin, help them restore their core strength, get strong abs, lose that extra baby weight around their waist, and fit into their clothes again to get out more, to do normal mom things with their baby outside of the home and not feel like they're stuck in the home because they don't feel good in their skin. If you need help with this, head on over to my program, Postpartum App Simplified, where I teach you step-by-step how to restore your core back to normal, plus some extra abs on top of it in the end. If you're ready to have your core strength back and to have your total body strength back just because the core is restored, if you're ready for this total body transformation, I'd love for you to join me in my program, Postpartum App Simplified, and I will help coach you along the way. It is my group program where I give you all the tools you need in order to fully recover after pregnancy. And the great thing is, once you're in, you get access for the rest of your life. So if you have more babies down the road, you get to come back to this program again and again. No more guessing, no more struggling, no more exhaustion, because this only takes 10 minutes a day, and it only takes 70 days. Head on over to livecorestrong.com slash PAS to learn more about my program, Postpartum App Simplified. Well, today's episode is for the C-section mom. If you had a C-section, you're definitely going to want to learn about scar massage. And if you have a friend or a sister who had a C-section, share this episode with them because they need to know this. This is information that probably the doctors didn't teach you, but you need to know. And these are physical therapy techniques to help break down your scar tissue. And why do we want to break down scar tissue? Because scar tissue can cause pain in the long run. It decreases mobility in your skin and it can be a little unsightly. So let's break down that scar tissue with scar massage. All right. So when are we supposed to be doing this? Well, you don't want to do it right away. You want to ask your doctor for approval for the right time to start your scar massage because only your doctor knows what your scar looks like. You and your doctor. I don't know what your scar looks like, so I can't tell you when exactly, but you want to be healing. You want to heal your scar up really well before you start any kind of massage. Now, when you are ready to start massage, I recommend massaging around your scar, not on top of your scar. Okay, so if you're understanding what I'm saying, you're massaging around the scar, more on your skin, not directly on top of the scar. Now, in the future, you will massage 
directly on top of the scar, but that's for a later stage. Okay, that's when your scar is fully healed. And I do have a YouTube video on how to do this. So if you are having trouble visualizing what I'm talking about, definitely head on over to my YouTube channel, which is Live Core Strong, and you can search for scar massage. Or even if you just Google scar massage video, I think I'm one of the first videos that pops up on Google. So you'll find me pretty quickly. And what you want to do is you want to do massaging in different directions because if you're going to massage just horizontally side to side well then your connective tissue is only going to be stretched in that direction but our connective tissue goes in all directions so we really do want to massage in all directions we want to go horizontally side to side we want to massage up and down vertically and we want to do circular patterns because that's really going to make sure that we are getting all the nitty-gritty you know massage angles and all the directions of our soft tissue, right? Because everything's going in all different directions. So you're going to be taking just a couple fingers and doing this massage and there's different pressure. You want to start with light pressure and eventually get more deep with the pressure that you're doing these massages. Again, this is a step-by-step -step process. You don't want to just go right into deep massage. It doesn't work that way. You have to start slow. If you need coaching on this, if you need help and guidance on how to implement these scar massage techniques, I'd love to coach you. You can definitely check out my calendar and book a strategy session with me, and I can help coach you along the way when it comes to these massages. But this is something that you can do on your own, or you can ask your husband to help you with these scar massage techniques. Now, how often should you be doing this? I recommend doing it every day, but you don't need to do it for a long period of time. You can do this for five minutes, for 10 minutes, at max, maybe 20 minutes. But again, I know your time is limited, so maybe just stick to 10 minutes. Don't feel pressured to do any longer than that. And you want to do it where you're comfortable, you're lying down, or you're in a sitting position, reclined, and you don't want to have a lot of tension in your body. You don't want to be in pain when you're doing scar massage. It should be rather painless or just slight uncomfortable feeling, but nothing too intense. Keep an eye on your scar to make sure that there's no infection. That's really important. You want to uh, see if there's any kind of smell, I guess, smell if there's an odor, but look to see if there's any kind of inflammation, redness, or kind of discharge. Keep an eye out for things like that, and you never want to open up your scar. So that's why you need to ask your doctor if everything is healed and ready to go before you start any kind of scar massage. Okay, now as time goes on, you will be massaging directly over the scar itself. And you want to get full approval that you are in the free and clear to put your fingers directly on top of your scar. And you will be doing similar techniques of that side to side motion, the up and down motion, and the circular patterns clockwise and counterclockwise. Okay, so that is a good starting point for you to understand what scar massage is and how to go about it. You don't want to go very intense at the beginning. You want to start light and then eventually over time, meaning over days and weeks and months, you will want to gradually increase the pressure. Okay, so go ahead and give your doctor a call. Don't hesitate. Call your doctor and ask when you are ready to do it. Your doctor might already know that you're ready to go right now to start doing your massages right now. So then the next step would be go over to my YouTube video and watch exactly how to perform these scar massages. Okay. And make sure that there is no signs of infection, no openness around your incision, and make sure that you are in the full healing phase of your scar. All right. If you have any other questions, definitely find me on Instagram at live core strong. You can DM me and better yet, come on over to our Facebook community where we can chat more and stay motivated to remain healthy during your postpartum recovery. We are a fit mom community and we love talking all things fitness. And I can't wait to have you over there so you can help strengthen your core even more than it already is. And remember to always live core strong. 
Did you learn something amazing today and feel like your mama friends would learn a lot too? You can have a huge impact on their lives and the lives of so many other moms by subscribing and leaving a review on iTunes or Apple Podcasts so the fit postpartum mom message can spread all over the world. New moms don't need to struggle anymore. The answers are all right here waiting for them. So take 30 seconds to share it. Take a screenshot of this podcast, tag me on Instagram, and post it in your stories. But before you go, please head over to Apple Podcasts, subscribe, and leave a five-star written review so you can help grow the Strong Mom community. I'd love to have you and your mom friends there with me. And as a thank you for being here all the way to the end, I have something special for you. I'm giving you free access to my training on how to safely start postpartum ab exercises in less than two minutes a day. Watch right now at www.livecorestrong.com slash class. I can't wait to see you next time on the Fit Postpartum Mom Podcast.